I'm standing, not in the rocking chair, actually. <laughs> uh, the book was, uh, you know, I didn't even know why I wrote the book. I had some agent in New York. She kept saying, God, you've got a lot of stories. You should write a book. And I said, about what? She said, memoirs. And I said, why would anybody want to know those? And she says, you know, you're inspirational. And I kind of laughed at that and said, I do what I have to do. But in the process of writing the book, and with everything to do with my mom, my mom was the most incredible lady in the world. Sixth grade education, and she, I mean, she had an IQ off the charts, I'm, I'm sure. All the things she said, defeat is no option. You never fail as long as you try. Don't you ever quit at anything. And don't let anybody treat you like a handicap. And all those things stayed with me all the way through life. When the book was finished, actually, Laura, my, my wife now, we got married just last month. She and I, uh, she did editing and went back and fixed a lot of stuff I had with the other writer. But the bottom line, after the book was written, I suddenly realized what the lady meant. So... One thing I'm hoping something comes out this for anybody that reads it, and that's the, the line of perseverance, never, never stop, never quit. No matter what you do, you don't fail as long as you try. You only fail when you don't try. So that's something I'm hoping that comes out of the book for everybody. All right, that's great. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.